Breakfast is ready, darling. Okay, come in now. Freshman year is finally here. Hey, I'm Luke by the way, Luke Drazen, and today I'll be joining Holbrook High School for Magic. Everyone is capable of developing some form of magical power, but how each person manifests that power is different, and that's what makes us unique. It's not enough to just have magical power, you have to learn how to control that power, which is a task in itself, but a lot of fun. This is how the students are divided into their classes, based on their skill level and which category they fall into. Oh yeah, the classes are the category your magic power falls into. If you're a creator, you have the ability to create living or non-living things from magical elements like ice, or you might have some spatial magic where... Wait, I'm talking too much. Well, it's my first day, so I can be a little excited I guess. In the spirit of the school's motto, the road to a magic user is never a simple one, so expect some disasters along the way and have a full, full adventure with it. Wow, this place is huge. I'd never expect it to be as big as this. Well, what did you expect, dummy? This is Hallbrook High, the School of Magic. Oh, and this is Damien Wilder. We've known each other since kindergarten. Well, we're practically brothers. Well, yeah, I expected that, but this place is just more than I expected. One of the top schools in the country. What else did you expect? Oh, and this is Connor Brain. He's as rule-binding as you can get. Always the good guy in any situation. Oh, and he's known for being a brain box, even though he's really not as clever as people give him credit for. Ah, you make a valid point. Why are we all just standing here? Let's head inside already. Yes, I don't want to be late on my first day. We're literally stood outside. How can we possibly be late? Well, if my memory serves me right, when we went to the movies to see Star Wars, we were just standing outside and we were late. Hey, that was your fault. You didn't want to pre-book the tickets. Exactly. I'm not taking my chances with you two. Hey, don't blame me. Over there, that seems to be where we register. From the looks of it, we're in the right place. Yeah, let's go before Fredo here gets angry. You'll never learn. Oh, hey Annabelle. This is Annabelle Kendrew. We met back in middle school where she was known for being somewhat mischievous. Better late than never, I suppose. If you must know, I've been here for the past six and a half minutes. <laughs> and I thought Connor was the nerd. Hey, I'm just knowledgeable about a lot of things. Nerd? I take great offense to that. Right, okay, on that note, let's get signed in before we're late than we already are. I've already signed in. I'll wait by the lockers for you guys.
Hi there. Welcome to Hallbrook High. Um, hi. We're here to register. Oh, of course. Well, you're in the right place. What are your names? My name is Luke Drazen. Ah, uh, yes. It looks like you'll be assigned to class 1A. Please take this form and complete this before your first class begins. You also have your class schedule and other information you might need there. Please take this form and complete this before your first class begins. You also have your class schedule and other information you might need there. Oh, thank you very much. Well, hey there, Dollface. If you must know, I'm Damian Wilder, the next best wizard. <laughs> You're funny, Mr. Wilder. You have also been assigned 1A, as mentioned to your friend, information and schedule. Thanks. Something tells me you're not taking me seriously. Ouch, shut down. Psh, you thought. Nailed it! The name is Connor Burain. Connor Burain. Hmm. Here it is. You have been assigned to Class 1B. Again, information and schedule for classes. Class... 1B? Damn, you didn't get placed in our class this week. <laughs> hey, doesn't B come after A, so like, that makes us better than little Fredo here, right? Absolutely not! First week classes aren't important as far as grading. We have to unlock our magic. So, no, this doesn't make you better in any way. Oops, I think I hit a nerve. Certainly not. You're just uneducated. Well, you could have fooled me. Anyways, let's go meet Annabelle before we head off to our first class. Well, I'm glad that's sorted now. So you've got your classes? Yeah, it looks like our first class is in 15 minutes. So who's in class 1C? So I'm alone? Wonderful. No boys to embarrass me. Woo! Bye, guys. Oh, that's how it is. I guess we should probably get going, too. Huh, <laughs> you guys have fun. Navigating this place will be a challenge on its own. Bye. Wait, we're gonna be so late. Um, yeah, I've no idea where we're going. Maybe it's, uh, this way. I don't think that's... Damien Wilder here! Is this class 1A? I suggest you leave, little boy, before you regret those actions. Uh, sorry. Well? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, no. No, that was not the right room at all. Ugh. As sorry we got lost. Being your first day, I'll let it slide. Find a seat. So again, for those who were late, welcome to class 1A. This will be a class for this week's sessions. During your first week here at Holbrook High, you will be here to awaken your own magic power. Now, this isn't always an easy task, but everyone has their own unique dormant magical power deep down inside you. My job is to help you find that. Now, during your enrollment here at Holbrook High, you were given a form to complete. If you haven't done this already, please complete the form now so we can continue today's class.
Thank you for completing these forms. Now, as I mentioned, you are all here to develop your own magical power. The system here allocates each student based on the magical power you develop during this week's sessions. You have one week to manifest your magical power. Otherwise, you will be expelled. Harsh, yes, but to study with us this year, you need to be on top form. One week, people. This guy is nuts. One week to develop our magic power? I know, right? I don't even know where to start. Is there a problem back there? Um, no sir. Sorry sir. Good. Now we'll talk about strategies to manifest your magical power. And that's how you concentrate the magical power. That will be all for now. Class dismissed. That was far too much for me to process in one session. He lost me when he started talking about aura pressure points. Damien, that was the first thing he spoke about. Exactly! I have no idea what he was talking about. Ugh. Well, looks like we have a break now before we resume class. Maybe we should head to the cafeteria? Food? Now we're talking! Haha, <laughs> agreed. Well, you see, it's not that hard when you get used to it. Wow, Connor. That's amazing. Well, I guess it is. Hey, Connor's here. Maybe we should go and join him. Huh, looks like Smarty Pants has made some friends. Hey, guys! Damien, don't just... Oh, hey, guys. Damien, do you have to be so loud? Loud? Pfft. Who's loud? I'm not loud, not me. You know, you worry me sometimes. So, are you going to introduce us to these new friends of yours? Oh, this is Crystal Rayner and Dylan Howarth. They're both in Class 1B with me. Lovely to meet you both. Wow, Connor. I didn't know you had more hot guy friends. Crystal, behave. Sorry, she can get a bit carried away. Did she just call me hot? Yes, Damien and no. Don't go there. I don't know what you mean. <laughs> Anyways, how did class go? Did they talk about awakening your magic? They did, even though Damien here got lost from the word go. Hey, I'm slow sometimes, alright? All the time, more like. Yeah, anyways, the worst part is we only have a week or we get expelled. Don't sweat it, guys. They only tell you that kind of thing to motivate you to awaken your magic power. Yeah, we'll all be just fine. <sighs> That's a relief. I just hope we all develop our magical power before the week ends. We will. Just you wait and see. Alright, I'm going to get some food. You coming, Luke? Sure, I'll be right there. They have my favorite! Ah! Same paradise. You guys and food. Sheesh. Oh, don't mind us. We just enjoy the little things in life. Wow, even the food is amazing. Everything about this place makes me feel great. You're so right. Well, it's been fun talking, guys, but we've got a class to get to. Meet you later? Sure thing, Connor. Catch you later. Nice to meet you guys. Same goes, Dylan. Bye, Crystal. <laughs> I think she likes me. 
Please no, Damien. Wear your heart in your sleeve, man. I'm pretty sure the line is wear your heart on your cheek, but okay. Oh well, I guess it's just the two of us then. Looking that way, with classes being like they are this week, we are probably going to be like this a lot. I guess so, but hopefully that will change once we've developed our magic. Same. Hopefully we join classes with Connor and the others. Wait a second. Did we just get outdone by Connor? Let's never speak of this moment again. Ah, we spent our lunch talking to Connor. No, please don't send me back into that room. Damien, that's the least of your worries. Welcome back, students. This afternoon's session will be shorter than this morning, so you have nothing to worry about. I understand I may have uh, overdone a few things, so let's rewind a bit. I didn't understand him the first time, and now he's going to repeat it? You need a repeat. Your memory's like a sieve. A sieve? Ugh. Come on, it's not working. Ugh. You're a real hothead sometimes, you know that, Luke. Oh, uh, hey Dylan. I guess I can be. I'm guessing you're not having any luck with the magic manifestation? Yeah, I can feel it within my aura. Manifesting it is the problem. You're a lot closer than most. Don't be so hard on yourself about it. So close, but yet so far. Don't give in, Luke. Maybe you're just trying too hard. Let it come naturally. Maybe, but the school doesn't give us time. Let me help. Just close your eyes and visualize your aura. Concentrate on that feeling. When you're ready, release that built-up energy. This way, you'll find your inner being. See, what did I say? Wait, what was that? Looks like fire to me. Looks like you're a flame elemental. A flame elemental? What's that? Students with elemental magic are able to control and manipulate an element. Seems your element is fire. You seem to be the first from this year's freshman students. Wow, you're incredible. Thanks for the help, Dylan. I didn't do too much, but thanks, I guess. No worries, bro. Thanks again. Well, I'll leave you to practice some more. See you tomorrow, Luke. Flame elemental magic? Has a nice ring to it. Uh, I guess I need to practice more. Strange. I thought flames were orange, not blue. 